so in this question um, we have a toroid with turns are given number of turns are given and a small cross section and we are supposed to find the field inside the core to that of the center of the toroid so b inside divide by b at the center of the toroid so first thing uh, we know that just like a solenoid inside a toroid field is mu not j where j is linear current density so j if you see in this diagram so this is b inside which is mu not j so j is the number if you take this part of the toroid so this length current flowing through this length so current per unit length we can call as j linear current density now this is approximately is equal to ni by 2 pi r see total turns are n and total length is 2 pi r so number of turns by 2 pi r times i is the current crossing per unit length so ni is the total current again on the periphery and 2 pi r is the length of the periphery so current density is total current ni divided by length of the periphery which is 2 pi r now this is an approximation because as you can clearly see here the inside the toroid the current density is more and outside it is less but we are given the cross section is small so we can assume it to be ni by 2 pi r so r is the middle of it now second thing we also know is if we have a loop current carrying loop then field at the center is mu not i by 2r so we will be using this this result when we will calculate the field at the center so once again the b inside the toroid is mu not j and j is ni by 2 pi r so we know now what is the b inside now we need to calculate what is b at the center now here we need to find this current in the toroid if you find this current in this toroid traveling in the circular loop then we can say that b in the center is mu not i by 2r so what is that current so let's call that current which is crossing this plane as ir which we'll be using here so i current is entering and let's say at the plane ir is crossing and i current is leaving so this we did in previous question also so there we did it with the solenoid coil that in a plane if the i current is entering and i current is leaving the solenoid then if you take any cross section then that current which is crossing through the plane is same as this i so ir is equal to i in both the cases which implies we'll use this result now that b at the center because of this current i is mu not ir by 2r and ir is equal to i so bo is mu not i by 2r now why ir is equal to i again as across any plane cutting the solenoid or toroid same amount of charge is crossing per unit time as is entering or leaving the whole circuit so what charge per unit time is entering same charge per unit time is crossing and same charge per unit time is leaving the circuit same here also so this is the field at the center and this is the field inside the toroid so we are we have to find the ratio of these two so just divide these two and you will get your answer